You know, if it wasn't for that little FPS drop, that I might make that my intro, like permanently, because that that that's good music, good ambience, good everything. We're just, we're just waiting on it. Hopefully soon. Hopefully, hopefully soon. Like in this next week, we'll see the first of the. Um, Videos come up from MechWarrior 5. But anyway, we're continuing this campaign. We are on Solaris. We are sticking with Inner Sphere only tech. Of which we have quite a bit. Looks good. Let's go. It's the weekend, Solaris fans, and that means the first light match of the season. This is Duncan Fisher bringing you the play-by-play -play as we prepare for the lightweight series. Boy, do we have a lineup for you today. There are some real up-and-comers in today's match. I wouldn't be surprised if we see some of these guys qualify for medium or, heck, maybe beyond. These guys are hungry for it. Game on! I think he's rethinking. Now he's running away. Enemy Back detected. Here. Ouch! That one's gotta hurt. Looks like that's one mech for the trash heap. mech fights is the ferocity of some of these pilots. A lot of Solaris fans tend to skip the light matches, and I think that's a mistake. A lot of these warriors have heart, which you don't get in some matches. Every time they go out, it is make or break for these guys, and I admire the heck out of that. It's best to dodge out of the way, not into it. I bet that pilot's thinking, hey, how'd I get hit? With reflexes like those, he should expect it more often. Detected. Get a lot of different types of pilots in these light matches. Not a big surprise, because these light mechs are cheap. A single weapon system on the assault circuit can cost more than an entire mech in this league. Anyone that can afford a flea, a couple of machine guns, and has some moxie can compete. That kid is on a roll down there. That last guy just got hammered.
Bam! It's game over. And that is it, Solaris fans. We have a winner. His name is Spectre, a mercenary turned Solaris pilot who has won the match tonight. I've never heard of the kid before, but that was one excellent performance. <laughs> So congrats to Spectre for his first Solaris victory. Until next time, Solaris fans, this is Duncan Fisher, signing off. I wonder what an urban mech in a heavier fight would look like. Probably not great. Holy hell! Uh, that doesn't look stock at all. Top speed, 84.6. Speed is zero. At 84.6. Sure. Roger control, three hours. Starting south of John Brady. This is forward one. You're running out of time. Party camera is nearly powered up. Well, if I drop the grouse for a long time, that'll leave me one light laser. I don't think we're going to do that just yet. Empty heat generating hardpoint. Only missile type or beam type weapons can be installed on this hardpoint. Okay. Weird. I don't even have any medium. Hello, Solaris fans, it's Duncan Fisher broadcasting live from the jungle. It has been a crazy time getting in. The security was so tight that some people are still trickling in. Oh, Tonight's match is, is packed with rookies, arena. which means it's going to be one hell of a fight. These guys are battling for position, and a couple of them are fighting the to stay on the medium circuit. The it's going to be a no-holds-barred fight tonight. The big crowd tonight is a good thing, too, because the medium season has been off to a slow start so far. The opening games have been pretty predictable, and last week there was a scandal when Bobby Killer Fields was accused of pulling <gasps> a game. But the fans haven't lost their faith, and tonight's game looks like it's going to be a good one. Ah, uh, Bobby Killer Fields did something bad. Showtime. Oh, hey, Marcus. Ouch. Okay, that was hard hit. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Keep up, Marcus. I hear one of the combatants down there is Ricardo Vecchi's cousin. He's been training with that's one down. Oh, splash damage. <laughs> well, Ricardo's cousin is history now. It's no secret that Vecchi and I do not get along. He thinks I'm an old has-been, and I don't even think I can broadcast what I think of him. No matter what my feelings are, though, he knows how to play the game. I see a lot of Ricardo's arrogance in his cousin, but none of his skills. Looks like a pretty good match out there today. A lot of folks prefer medium to light matches because there is more action. You have more power to bear on your- Two kills! Not bad for a rookie. Warning. Damage critical. How the hell can you fit all that weaponry in that thing? He's on a roll. That's three chalk marks for- I lost a medium laser. Shit. 
Alright, Shadow Cat and a Hellhound. I might be a little bit more worried of the Hellhound. So the talk is all about last week's medium Especially match. since he's the last Bobby one Bobby Fields had been cleaning house in the medium circuit. He made the final two in the last factory match. Then a badly mauled Merrick rookie simply tore him apart. Fields barely even fired back. All the media is saying that the killer took a dive. And he goes out in second uh. place. An excellent performance. Splash damage got me. And I lost my Gauss Rifle, didn't I? Yes. To redeem ourselves. We have some medium mech action tonight. This is Duncan Fisher live from Solaris. The pilots are on the field and they look in good form. There is some speculation that a couple of the pilots might advance into the heavier circuits this season. They definitely have their game faces on and are ready to duke it out. Action! I know that guy. I owe that guy a kill. The medium matches are some of my favorites, and I'm not saying that just because it was the weight class I made a name for myself in. Medium mechs require all the piloting. There's the ejection pod. One less combatant on the field. Oh, Jesus Christ, uh, let me just, you know, do this and kind of help you out here. Target destroyed. I can't hit for shit. Plus, this hell spawn's coming back. Warning. Heat the medium matches are picking up some steam from a slow start. 
It was a real upset when a few of the key medium players announced they were only going to be competing in the heavier circuits. Let Salvo had his name on it. Warning. Each level critical. Shut down imminent. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Another mech down, this time to Spectre. That's his second of the match. I'm gonna rip your arms off. Gotta run. Bam, bam, bam. Spectre makes it look easy. Now let's see if he can go the distance. And that's it. They messed me up. Man, that's medium mech action for you. We have our winner today, Merc turned Solaris Jock Spectre. He's making a name for himself, and he rode right over the competition today. Some pilots on the circuit complain that the jungle is a hard arena to get used to. Well, apparently there's one Merc who'll disagree. Live from the jungle, it's Duncan Fisher signing off. I like it because there's water. <laughs> and you can run hot builds like this. Oh yeah, home turf. Home turf for an urban mech. In Montenegro, the sun is setting behind Merrick Tower. People are still crowding the streets, waiting to get into one of Solaris' most popular arenas. You know what that means? That's right, Solaris fans! It's factory time! This is Duncan Fisher, and we have an exciting, fast-paced, lightweight Solaris match for you, you tonight. just imagine Many how big this building is, Solaris that has other in the lightweight in circuit, it. So perhaps we'll see some future stars tonight. So stay tuned for some intense action in like the Like, this junction. building itself is several blocks huge. The game is on. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Stop dodging. Unlucky for you, it's not that easy for me to reach. Sometimes a kill sneaks up on you, like that one. Pinpoint firing can lead to a fast kill. Well, that's a good turn around here. This is the sort of fighting you don't get in any other weight class. Mechs zigging this way and that. Munitions fire all over the place. This is classic light mech action. You need to be able to do precision piloting and quick thinking. Some of these guys are really on, and it should be a great match. One more mech destroyed. I think I stunned him. The guy was just kind of standing there like, wait, what the hell happened? Why am I missing an arm all of a sudden? Who's got a PPC at this level? Except for a panther. Oh, it's Terrence. Fans sometimes find these light matches hard to follow. Who got nailed by who? Heck, most of the time you don't recognize any of these names. But that is part of the charm. When I was a kid, I remember seeing some hotshot nobody dominate a season on the light circuit. Later, he was a Solaris champion. They're just something magical when you watch someone's career from the beginning. That's why I think fans who tune out light matches are really missing out. Sometimes a fight is all about position. Right now, people are lining up shots, but are mostly on the defensive. You never can tell when situations like this are going to break. And then there'll be a lot of action on the kill board. Bam, bam! Two kills for Spectre. Man, that guy was annoying. Come here, Terrence. He's out of weapons. That's why he's not shooting. 
Fancy yeah. piloting, good aim, and three kills for Spectre. Now that is one Merc I'd let watch my back any day. It's kind of bad because I think Alex's Cougar has a little bit more firepower than I do. Well, except that he's all LRMs. That's it. Hooray, right, victory jump. Fast and furious, that's the way the light mech competitions go. Our winner tonight is Spectre, a rookie Solaris pilot to watch. He's earned his victory lap. Live from the factory, this is Duncan Fisher signing off. See you next match, Solaris fans. For any of you watching this in the future, if you're wondering why it looks like I'm driving a Mark II all the time, um, Mech tech could do everything from adding new mechs, adding new weapons, adding, changing hardpoints and everything. They could not add in new damage diagrams. They could modify them, but they could not add new ones in. So they just decided to take the Mark II, which has basically, you know, an armor area for everything else that they added in, and uh, use that instead. So that's why it's with the Nurban Mech, I'm driving a Mark II with no fans. This is Duncan Fisher, announcing from a completely packed Coliseum. As a Mark III. Steiner's Coliseum is the only open-class arena where spectators can watch the game live, and it looks like the fans are really taking advantage of that today. The light mech pilots are getting onto the field, and it looks like we're going to have a heck of a game for you today. Now we're Fear my action. trash can. Hey, what say you and I play nice? Friends until we take the rest of these jokers out? I've keyed you to me. friendly on my IFF. He knocked me again! That was that little beep. When the reactor goes, that's usually a sign that you've taken too much damage. The lightweight matches are all about a trade-off. You want more firepower or more speed? When I was on the field, I can tell you how I always went. Guns, 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 guns. and more guns. I think speed is good out in the real world, but when all I am facing are other light mechs, I want to have the power to rubble my opposition fast. Man, that kid was on fire. He went the distance longer than any of us could expect. Of course, now he is literally on fire. Great, I'm but between hey, Peter, Dexter, and Terrence again. Terrence is the only one that has a PPC on that wolfhound. Now it's just the final three. Oh great, and it's all of us over here. Oh wait, Terrence is taking out. Now we have just two. Should be a good match. One thing I absolutely love it. Spectre wins. Bam! That's it for today. The winner is Spectre. The Fear the trash can. Turns Hilaris Jock. He's chalked up another victory on the sands of the Coliseum. I just bet we'll be seeing more of him. Well, take care, Solaris fans. This is Duncan Fisher signing off. Plus, I think my Hollander's fixed. The sun is set behind the Coliseum. The stadium lights are on, and we have a game tonight. This is Duncan Fisher giving you the play-by-play. -play. There are a couple of Steiner up-and-comers in tonight's game, and it has drawn quite a crowd. In the last Coliseum game, there was some real tension in the stands. The Davion and Steiner supporters seemed like they were coming close to blows. But the security is tight, and all signs point to a fabulous game. It's Solaris time. Oh, right, I solved it out for an easy 10. Because I lost the freaking Dallas rifle. That's right. I remember now. 
Okay, that Ryokin is already almost dead. Um, so do I worry about him or do I worry about what hit him? One of the combatants tonight is both a Merc and Solaris Jump. His name is Alex. Oh, that one is definitely down. I'm gonna keep you off kilter with this pulse laser. There's a lot of debate on which mech dominates the medium mech circuit. My money's always on the Uzio. Sure, you can put another five tons of armor and weapons on other chassis, but I just like the feel of an Uzio. It has good armor, weapons, and decent moves. Some lucky pilots who have access to clan tech go with the Shadow Cat. I can see their point, but clan tech is expensive to repair and keep up. You are really putting a lot on the line bringing a clan mech into Solaris. Some of the Solaris jocks take a special joy in singling out clan mechs just to watch their pilots squirm. I'm stuck between two guys that are firing at me. Destroyed. I'll go figure. I like that guy. Fuck you, style. Alex. He came out punching and didn't give up until his mech was power. Heck, I bet he's still trying to fire at the other guy. Damage critical. <laughs> Damn it. Wifey's over in the other room right now. Failed to place. Lost some money there. <sighs> okay. Oh, the Hollander still okay. Interesting. I need my Gauss rifle back. Also, an Ultra AC-20 could be a fun, fun gun to run. Twenty damage, nineteen heat. Large continuous beam laser. You know what? Let's give Let's give this a try. I don't think I've ever really used the beam laser. Okay, that's all of my tonnage. Give this a try. The sun is set behind the Coliseum. The stadium lights are on. Yeah, maybe. I don't think the snow's tonight. actually going to reach this us. This is Duncan Fisher giving you the play-by-play. -play. Play. There are a couple of Steiner up-and-comers in tonight's game, and it has drawn quite a crowd. In the last Coliseum game, there was some real tension in the stands. The Davion and Steiner supporters seemed like they were coming close to blows, but the security is tight, and all signs point to a fabulous game. It's Solaris time! We're gonna sneaky sneak our way through this.
One of the combatants tonight is both a Merc and Solaris Jeff. His name is Alex Haight. This no-nonsense fighting machine had a All right, I was going to leave you for later, but okay. <laughs> well, Alex is slumming it, and he gets nailed. He was scoping out the competition, and looks like he found some. I don't know whether he was just overconfident, or if he just got outplayed, but regardless, I bet he ain't a happy camper. See you next game, Alex. There's a lot of debate on which mech dominates the medium mech circuit. My money's always on the Uzio. Sure, you can put another five tons of armor and weapons on other chassis, but I just like the feel of an Uzio. It has good armor, weapons, and decent moves. Some lucky pilots who have access to clan... Welcome to Solaris. Now, let me show you the sky. Survive that one. That's two for Spectre and two ejected pilots who will be watching from the sidelines. Hello. Oh yeah. Target destroyed. Is laughing her ass off. I can hear her. It's no big secret oh, yeah? that I'm partial to the medium circuit. It's the circuit I made a name for myself in. So the way you know those mechs like the back of my hand. Before it goes Sometimes on I'm in the Valhalla because, Club. You know, I hear some of the players service. come down on the and, lighter uh, circuits. I think that's just wrong. Apparently Every person that competes on blocks. any level in Solaris is Coco. a real warrior. And if you take some of those pilots out of their atlases and stick them in chimeras, I bet they'd learn a lot about humility. How are we on ammo? We're through a ton of ammo so far. So we're doing okay. Target destroyed. Did, did I kill him? The Merc Phenom strikes again. The Coliseum has seen some intense fighting tonight. Ultra AC Although those 20 medium mechs are fast, hurt. they can pack some serious punch. It was quite a slugfest, and rookie Merc Spectre takes the victory today. He smashed through some serious opposition, and he's earned the accolades tonight. Live from the sands, it's Duncan Fisher wishing all of you a good night. I don't know what those, like, Icarus-style, like, boots are on the Hotlander. It's a little, little funky. Did I do medium on the factory? I don't think I did. Let me let me see what this continuous laser is like. Uh, six tons, six tons, six tons. Get rid of that. Large continuous beam laser, range nine hundred. Seems like a lot of range for Intersphere laser tech. The factory is a buzz tonight. That's right, it is factory time. This is Duncan Fisher reporting live from downtown Montenegro. And the talk tonight is about Because if you think about Dexter. it, that's longer than... He has come out of retirement um, and is anxious to get another chance at the Solaris lasers. Championship. By 100 His meters. last light game was a brutal display of skill, and this old dog has learned some new tricks. There is a sold-out crowd here tonight. It's Solaris time! Alright, that Hellspawn immediately fell over, so whoever he, he's fighting, we're gonna shoot first. And of course, that's Peter Dexter. Peter Dexter is down there tonight. Back in his prime, it would have been a no brainer who was gonna win this one. But he's been in retirement for five years, and it's been eight years since he did his career best and placed 37th in the charts. He's back and nailed three victories in a row in the light circuit. Now he's primed to show the medium pilots what an old veteran can do. He ain't getting any younger, but he has a ton of talent and experience. I fought Peter back in the day, and he is one pilot who cannot be ignored. I Gotta think cool we'll be seeing a lot to track up another kill. So we're hurting him, just very, very minor hurt with his beam laser. Warning, heat exceeding recommended level. 
Each level critical. Shutdown imminent. Each level critical. Shutdown imminent. Shutdown overridden. We're gonna pull away here a little bit and cool off. Medium mechs have a healthy blend of firepower and speed. You don't spend a minute waiting for two guys. Some fights are epic. Some you talk about for years to come. Some are like this one. Clean and efficient and get you one step closer to the championship. Not much of a looker, but it gets the job done. Our engine speed came back just in time for me to escape that shot. Alright. Ouch! And there goes Peter Dexter. A real shame, too. I thought he'd go the distance today, and I really I saw he had nothing left on the center torso, so just one I think little shot with the beam, it too. beam laser. But there are plenty of games left in the season, and I'd be surprised if we don't see some more from the Grey Wolf. Oh, hi, Alex. Oh, wow. Alex is really messed up. How about that hellhound? This is like a mouse aim weapon. That's the second one for Spectre today. Warning. We have our winner. Target destroyed. Things are really picking up now. The season may have started yeah, slow, for but now it's picking up steam. Today we have a Merc rookie doing the victory lap. His name is Spectre, and this season he has really been turning some heads. He fought his way through the light class and seems to be holding his own in the mediums as well. Live from the factory, it's Duncan Fisher signing off. And do you guys actually see any like viable use for a continuous beam laser? Like aside from the 900 meter range? Uh, I really don't see anything good for it. These are both heavy. Uh, the recently formed stick commonality has been a hotbed of fighting in and around the central region of the Chaos March. The planet stick is at the center of the conflict and is and it is home to the Tau Mechworks. The conflict is extremely chaotic as the Capella Confederation has unleashed numerous mercenary and marauder units in an attempt to mask grazing aggression against the commonality. Yeah, Leo Leo is a, doing very good in, in terms of the whole inner sphere. Like, I think the clans have now more territory than only Al does. Uh, anywho. Let's see here. I'm gonna get salt mixed again. Not purple. Alright, one, two. That counts. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine ten. Yeah, we got enough for at least, you know, a good heavy lance. Hold on a second, I'm going to close my chat here a moment. AS7-D. Or where are we at? 3067? 3066? See if there's a unit, see if there's a variant in here where it actually has... Actually, it might be. Okay, let's look at this. The AS7K, 3050's combine upgrade of the Atlas that used Rediscover Starlink technology. The K-Model was built around a Velar 300 XL engine carry a uh, Shigunga LRM-20. No. Uh, the Imperator Dragons fire Gauss Rifle, yes. Uh, backed up by a pair of ER Large Lasers, no. Uh, continue use of 20 single heat sinks cause swift heat buildup and bo if both lasers are fired repeatedly for close range. Carried two medium pulse lasers, no. 
Alright. Uh, K2, post jihad. 64.8. No. Alright, K3. Two streak SRMs. No. K4. Where to be five? Nope. I'm trying to see if one of these standard builds... Oh wait, the S3... here. Heavy Gauss Rifle was reduced to the standard Gauss Rifle with 16 shots uh, while each arm contains a PPC and a small laser. An AMS is installed on the left arm. Lambs. Uh, fracture defense. Yeah. Okay. The Artemis IV enhanced LRM-15 and Guardians uh, ECM suite. Okay. So it can't fit the LRM, the Artemis LRM-15 because it needs a third crit here. Uh, I don't know where the rocket launcher 20 is coming in, but it looks like this is the S3. And there's also a dual cockpit refit. Okay, so it's close closest to an S3. So that is actually kind of stock, but not really. Is that rocket launch really a ton and a half? Yes, it is. And it is single use, as it should be. Which means I'm not going to use it. Lasers backed up by three medium lasers. Gauss rifle and LM. Actually, let's split this up to two LRM 10s. I mean, that's kind of a waste of weight. And we'll do one order. I don't need an IFF jammer. I don't need ECM. We'll do extra speed. Okay. Gauss rifle. Those there, that there. That there. That's a good build. I like that boat. Awesome's good. Black Knight is. I don't understand the scaling of, of this ammunition at all. You have 120 rounds with one ton of ammo for the AC-5. The AC-10 only gets 36. And the AC-20 is obviously a lot less than that. Let me think here. the heat a bit, or the heat efficiency, I should say.
take out the APU dance as soon as possible. If the drop stick gets powered up, it'll bring its main guns online. Omega we'll left. We're getting cargo secure. As soon as brave to lift. Get on the bridge. Now it's back to the car system. We can drive on the air, Joel. We can get intercepted. Oh no! We're <laughs> I forget what's on my other mauler. Yeah. Alright, new expert it is, let's go. We need to recon the island and locate the Jade Falcon Center of Operations. We don't have much to go on. I've set up a pair of routes to cover likely areas. Claymore gets his atlas. <laughs> sure, it'll get the Black Knight. Goof will get the awesome. Get against the Marauder. No, Marauder, not Mauler. And we'll split the Maulers into these two lances. Reinforced heavy lances. Actually, there's a Castle. There's a We're departing lance. coastal drop site on the northwesterly route. We'll check in every ten minutes. Over. Roger, Commander. We'll be here. We're in hostile territory, people. Give a ready report and check your sectors. Claymore reports ready up. Ready up. This is Hannibal. Ready up. Good. Remember, this is clan we're going up against. Combat mech warriors bred for battle with the hottest omni mechs this side of Outreach. This is your idea of a pep talk, Commander? Dirty clanners. I say waste them all. The fiercer the foe, the sweeter the salvage. Oh yeah! Kill the meat, save the metal. Roger, lead. Roger, six. Roger. Copy. Freebirds come, prepare for battle. Here we go, engaging clan mechs. Oh, there you are. Target eliminated. Targets destroyed. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Copy. That guy didn't even get a chance to hit the ground. Close up and form on me. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Copy. Roger, six. As we still have people in the water. Close up and form on me. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger, six. Damn it, Mustang, get your lines up here. Oh, look at that. Claymore at the nav point. I have reached the nav point. Nav point. Attack your closest target. Roger that. Copy. Roger lead. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Take out the designated target. Copy. Roger. Roger lead. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. This is Star Captain Jeff Roshak of the Jade Falcon Clan. I will crush your worthless forces beneath my talons and make you all my bondsmen. Neg, you'll be eating dirt in about two minutes, Air Roshak. Ah, 
To the death, then. You speak as only a barbarian could. You are no warrior. Let's see about that. Another one. Bite the dust. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target Fire. destroyed. Can, can take can out you step the designated off the target, target. Roger. I can't help you there, Spectre. Roger. Sorry, sir. Unable to comply. Roger, Lee. I cannot comply. Roger, Lee. Sorry, sir. No can do. You're out of luck on that one. Unable to comply. No can do. Now point out of reach. Roshak is history. Scope is clear. Continuing search pattern. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger. Roger they tell them to shoot Roger. that guy. Roger. They say, Roger. can't do that. They shoot him anyway. Gotta get a Steiner Scout Squad going. Map point. Roger. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Copy. Roger. Roger. Smoke staying at the nav. Nav point beta. No sign of clan or operations. Nav point beta. Reached. Spectre, this is Sky Eye One. I have visual on five clan mechs in a code. Grid one one seven. Relay position. You know, I don't think we ever learned star from of at 117. We're on it. Castle, this is Spectre. Engaging clan forces at 117. Looks like a pirate supply depot. Bet they didn't expect the clan to come calling. Acknowledged. Updating operations. Suggest eliminate clan forces and secure for salvage. We're working on it. I'm at the nav point, sir. I have reached the nav point. I guess bird dog. Close up and form on me. Roger! Roger, lead. Copy. Roger. Radar off. We're Passive sensors nice. engaged. Close, It's like I figured out what causes global warming. Somebody with some pulse lasers. Just going around shooting every tree they can. That's what's starting the California fires. Somebody's messing around with pulse lasers. They're right down there. Roger, six. Roger, Roger, Spectre. Nav point Gamma reached. Warning, heat exceeding recommended level. Warning. Okay, everybody's shooting my black knight. Warning, heat exceeding recommended level. Punch in out! And he was kind of just stuck there, overheated. Roger, Six. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Target destroyed. Destroyed. How are you still alive after so many PPC hits? It 
somebody nerf PPCs? What is this, NWO? We're clear. All forces, prepare for recovery and salvage. Damage Target ready, you lost one of my mess. Target's destroyed. Target taken out! No sign of their operation center, Castle. I'm returning to the LZ. Let's start planning our next patrol. Acknowledged. Castle out. Guess I'll have to buy a Sunder instead. I don't know if I've told you this before, sir, so but it was the clan that. invasion of 3050 that left me orphaned and oh, fleeing Shredder's the Rasselhag Republic. It's very fitting to finally help pay these bastards back on a personal level. Rip Shredder, but you had it coming. Uh, I, I can't, I can't really mourn your loss. Uh, you shut down. You couldn't control your heat, and you freaking shut down. Uh, let's do mags. Sell those. Sell those. Or one of them, anyway. Sell that. I should probably give that longbow to somebody who's like a good shot, but it, you know, just terrible at piloting so they don't run, for, run forward at all. build of a uh, atlas in here. We're almost at our scout squad level. With the limited information we've gathered on the island's topography,
I like it. I like it. Let's do it. Castle, this is Spectre. We are deployed at the southern beach and preparing to cross the line of departure. All units, set heading to Nav Point Alpha. Roger. 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 Acknowledged, Oh, yeah. These clan bastards have been keeping a very low profile. Keep alert for power down mechs and enemies running with passive sensors. Copy that. We'll be careful. You can turn on light amplification by hitting A. Okay, people, I've said it before and I'll say it again. These clanners are dangerous and not to be underestimated. Clanners? <laughs> I say waste them all. Roger, lead. Roger, copy. Roger, six. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Copy. Exceeding recommended level. He's gonna explode. Nav point alpha reached. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Target destroyed. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Copy. Roger. Contact. They're running passive. Watch yourselves. I have visual on the enemy. Roger. Castle, Spectre elements engaging full star of Clan Mechs. Vicinity nav point alpha. Looks like mediums and lights. Acknowledged. Give them hell, sir. Take out the designated target. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Enemy detected. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. You know what? Everybody the just shoot him. Target. Roger, Spectre. Roger. 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 Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Hold up! I'm on your side here! Fire, that's a friendly. My bad. Target taken out. That's who I saw on my radar. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Roger. Oh, God, this guy's in the wrong neighborhood. I feel like I always come too heavy to this mission, but then it's like, yeah, okay, we're fighting the clan, and these guys are supposed to have, like, the best piloting okay, and Falcon the best gunnery. At Alpha is elimininated. Uh, so I'm like, I'm, I'm totally cool to taking an assault rifle. Close against. up and form on me. Roger. 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 Because eventually that assault lance is going to be needed for that beach fight. up and form on me. Copy. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Roger, six. We're strung out over like a kilometer here. Let's group up, please. I can only hope that the uh, AI in MechWarrior 5 is a little bit better. Which is why... I'm opting for just running with a lance of people. So if you guys are getting MechWarrior 5, hey, shoot me a PM, whisper me, hit me up on Discord, hit me up on YouTube, whatever. Say, hey, I'm interested in playing with a lance of guys. You guys know when I stream, MechWarrior 5 will be streamed, and uh, you guys can see what I'm capable of. As we wait for our Goof and Blackjack's just kind of standing there. 
Roger, lead. Come on, Blackjack. How bad did I hit? Who did I hit? Claymore? Hannibal? Jeez, that was two PPCs worth? Jesus Christ. I think they nerfed PPCs. And they are not running reflective armor, they're just running standard trail fibrous. Close up and form on me. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Roger, Six. Roger. Well, here's the nest. Castle. Confirm Jade Falcon dropship 400 meters southwest of Nav Point Delta. Copy that. Intelligence from Calhouns indicates the Clanners have no more than two dropships on planet. Take that bird out, and we'll see how they fly with a clipped Enemy wing. Detected. Watch yourselves, people. That thing is loaded for bear. Engaging a second star of clan mechs, vicinity Gamma. They sure are determined. Looks like a mix of mediums led by a heavy. Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Roger. Roger, Lee. Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Copy. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. It's actually pretty impressive that these guys can dump by their missiles destroyed. and, uh, Target you know, destroyed. Hit. Target's destroyed. Target's destroyed. Target's destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, lead. Roger, six. Enemy. Roger, lead. Roger, Spectre. Each level critical. Shut down imminent. Warning. Approaching critical heat level. Target destroyed! Target's destroyed. Target's destroyed. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Copy. Roger, lead. Roger, Spectre. Copy. One of these things Spectre doesn't reporting belong here. second star of Clan Mex destroyed. Hopefully there's good salvage in there. Aye, that is good news. Target destroyed! Target destroyed. Target's destroyed. Enemy Target's detected. destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Enemy copy. Detected. Roger, Spectre. Check Enemy fire, detected. that's a friendly! Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Target's destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed! Target's destroyed. Roger, lead. Roger. Roger, lead. Copy. Take out the designated target. I'm gonna Roger, die! Spectre. Roger. 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 Spectre! Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, I know. Spectre's yeah. down! With the limited information we've gathered on the island... See, I just feel like there's something wrong with the, uh... PPCs. And I don't quite know what to do with... Man, that's hot. Castle, this is Spectre. We're deployed at the southern... Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Spectre. Copy. Roger. Okay, people, I've Clonk. said it before and I'll say they it again. Each other. These clanners are dangerous and not to be underestimated. Clanners? <laughs> I say waste them all. Staying at the nav. 
Roger. 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 Roger, Spectre. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Heat level critical. Shutdown imminent. Destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. All right, let's go trip Nav Alpha. Come on. Nav point Alpha reached. Copy. Roger. Roger. Roger six. Contact. Detected. They're running passive. Watch yourselves. I have visual on the enemy. Roger. Castle. Spectre elements engaging full star of Clan Mechs. Vicinity nav point alpha. Looks like mediums and lights. Acknowledged. Give him hell, sir. Take out the designated target. Roger. Roger, six. Where'd go? Roger, Spectre. Think they're scrapeared. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Take out the designated target. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Enemy Roger, lead. Roger. Enemy detected. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Roger that. Roger. 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 Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Roger, lead. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, lead. Roger, lead. Copy. Take out Please the designated target. Roger. Targets destroyed. Exceeding recommended level. Heat level critical. Shutdown imminent. Target destroyed! Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Jade Falcon Star at Alpha is eliminated. Just what the universe needs. Five less planners. Continuing to nav point beta. Roger, lead. Roger, six. Roger, six. Roger. Whoops. Shit. Wrong button. Trying to remember how to turn the HUD off. <sighs> Let me see here. It's not bad, but we're still missing something, like heat efficiency. Big mission gun. All right, let's With try to not kill myself this time. My bad. Castle, this is Spectre. We're deployed at the southern beach and... Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Copy. Roger. Roger. Roger, Lee. Okay, people, I've said it before and I'll say it again. These clanners are dangerous and not to be underestimated. Clanners? <laughs> I say waste them all. Roger that. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Roger that. Copy. Roger. Roger. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target taken out. Roger that. Roger, Six. Roger. Roger, lead. Nav point Alpha reached. Nav point. Nav point reached. 
I'm at the nav point, sir. Claymore at the nav point. Did, did they hit your cockpit? No, okay. Roger, lead. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger. That rain sound is really making me need to pee. Contact. They're running passive. Watch yourselves. I have visual on the enemy. Roger. Castle, Spectre elements engaging full star of Clan Mechs. Vicinity nav point alpha. Looks like mediums and lights. Acknowledged. Give him hell, sir. Roger that. Copy. Copy. Take out the designated enemy target. Detected. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Roger six. Oh man, he just got kind of plastered. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Roger Lee. Are you gonna try to kick me in the head? Target taken out. Roger six. If my lance could very nicely pick out a cooler as we have taken out, you know, three mechs in the meantime, that would be great. Somebody got me hot. Target taken out. Jade Falcon Star at Alpha is eliminated. Just what the universe needs. Five less planners. Continuing to nav point beta. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger. Roger. Beta looks clear. Continuing sweep to gamma. Roger, lead. Nav point. Nav point beta. Reach. Roger, sir. <laughs> Roger. Roger, lead. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Happy. Roger, lead. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger, Spectre. Roger, copy. Roger, six. Yeah, now that everybody's dead and all we're doing is shooting trees, is now we get the gas music, which really makes me want to shoot more trees. Oh, there you are. Watch yourself, Spectre. You've walked into a minefield. If you move slowly, you should be able to spot the mines. Either avoid them or shoot them, but be careful. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger. Roger, lead. They're taking Roger, this rendezvous Spectre. thing Roger very, six. very seriously because, uh, like, I'm the only one going up the middle. The other eight of them, seven of them, are going up the sides. Except for here comes Claymore. Part of me knew that was Claymore. I don't know what part, but it was like, I bet you that's Claymore. Nav point gamma reached. Enemy detected. I'm at the nav point, sir. Engaging Enemy a second detected. star of clan mechs, vicinity gamma. They sure are determined. Looks like a mix of mediums led by a heavy. Take out Enemy the designated detected. target. Copy. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Let's go help the Lance Enemy detected. Here. Somebody's over here getting thrashed around. Mags. We're coming, Mags. Damn mine. I saw that at the last second. Enemy detected. Could not avoid it. Target taken out. Roger, Spectre. 
Complete exceeding recommended level. I am running out of ammo. Also Target trying to destroyed. take some of these Target hits for Max. Target destroyed. Roger lead. Roger six. Roger lead. He takes the recommended level. Looks like Warning. this is goodbye. He takes the recommended level. Each level critical. Shut down imminent. Can my lance get the fuck over here, please? Weapon jammed with one shot left. Uh, please back off, play more. Please get Targets away from destroyed. play more. Targets destroyed. Take out the designated target. Copy. Copy. There we go. Ammunition. Targets destroyed. Target destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger. Copy. Where are you running? Oh, you're running at Well, me. Okay. here's the nest. Castle, confirm Jade Falcon dropship, 400 meters southwest of Nav Point Delta. Copy that. Intelligence from Callahan indicates the Clanners have no more than two dropships on planet. Take that bird out, and we'll see how they fly with a clipped wing. Watch yourselves, people. That thing is loaded for bear. Spectre reporting second star of Clan Mechs destroyed. Hopefully there's good salvage in there. That's good news. Target's destroyed. Target destroyed! Roger. Roger, Spectre. Copy. I can't believe I actually have range on that thing here. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Who the hell level. is shooting at what? Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. I hear a bunch of PPCs going off. Close up and form on me. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Spectre. Oh, Roger, that's that guy firing. Okay. I mean, I'll just, I'll just stand here. I can just stand here and let you shoot into the mountainside. Warning. He took seating. But, but like, we know level. it's active. Why can't I not? Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Like, you guys see what I'm saying, right? I'm shooting Warning. it. It Heat shoots at me. Recommended level. But I can't target the damn thing. Warning. Heat level critical. Shut down imminent. Alright, let's get closer. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Roger. As Enemy soon as detected. we get everybody up Enemy here. detected. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Roger, hey, Spectre. Shoot that Roger. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. Target, Target destroyed. destroyed. Target destroyed. Target's destroyed. Roger, Six. Roger, lead. Take out the designated target. Roger. Warning. Damage critical. Weapon destroyed. Son of a bitch. I need to pull back here. Can everybody Take out just the like designated target, target that guy copy, and kill copy. it? Roger, Spectre. Target's destroyed. destroyed. Target destroyed. Target's Next destroyed. One. Take out the designated target. Roger. Roger. Copy. Oh, shit, fuck. Roger, lead. Roger, Shoot six. Shoot that one instead. Roger, six. Target, 
Target destroyed. destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Six. Roger, Six. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Roger, Lead. Copy. Roger, Six. Ah, that's a nice target alpha. Did destroyed. it. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Castle, drop ship destroyed. Update the Calhound liaison. I'm on it, sir. That clan dropship nets us a considerable bonus. Great work, Commander. With one of their dropships taken out, they'll have to leave forces Max behind if dead. they withdraw. Not that I expect them to. Keep up the pressure, sir, and we'll drive these vermin right into the ocean. Alright, who do we like? Bullseye it is. Ah, oh, come on, I need a new atlas. I do not need 13 mission guns, alright? Alright. Crap, I don't know if I have another large X pulse laser. Because why not? If we have to take machine gun arrays, we're gonna take a lot of machine gun arrays. Alright, we picked up two Sunders to replace our broken ass Steiner Scout Squad. Uh, can, can, can I please get the correct screen up here? Like, what, what the hell is going on? That was a little buggy. Okay, there we go. This is a smidge buggy. A little bit. I don't think it needs four large lasers, I'd rather have uh, the nice backup weapons. 
One ton, one ton, one ton, one ton. Two tons, two tons, two tons, two tons. It's gonna make it a little hot, but... Sundos are always kind of nice to, to make interesting builds with. I hate how you have to go through and do like a uh, oddball method of doing things in order to advance time. Any Highlanders available? A lot of small lasers, that's a very, very, very weapons loadout. It really does not need that many small pulse lasers when you can just have medium pulse lasers instead. Okay, sir, if you're serious about going through with this trial of possession, I'll broadcast your intent to the clanners. I suggest outfitting both of our lances with the best tech available. Meeting clanners on their own terms won't be easy. This. Attention! This is Star Colonel Aisa Fastus of the Jade Falcons. I claim these islands in the name of Khan Martha Pride. I bring to this trial of possession a full binary of mechs. This is Spectre One, commander of this Highlander's company. I refute your claim to this territory. I bring two lances of warriors to end this struggle. Two lances against two stars of Jade Falcons? The two I'm sorry, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I gotta move this. Those two atlases right there, right where my camera was, are just looking at me like, is is he fucking serious? Are 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 we really gonna do this? We're gonna die. We're just gonna die, like dear God. Alright. Role playing over. You underestimate us! Do you wish to rebid your position, Star Colonel? Meg! You will suffer for your insolence! Well bargained and done. Come and get me. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Roger. Roger, Six. Roger. Roger. Roger, Six. Roger, Spectre. Copy. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were enjoying this a little too much, sir. Facing down the clan, outnumbered in the field of honor? I was born for this fight. Just make sure you live to finish it. Roger. I'm planning on it. Target eliminated. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, Six. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Roger, Spectre. Target's 
destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger. Wrong button. Target taken out. Roger, Spectre. Copy. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Their forces at 50% strength. We're doing slightly better. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger, lead. Roger, lead. Roger. Copy. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Roger, six. Roger. Roger, lead. Roger. Three Falcons remain. Finish them off, Commander. I'm on it. Target eliminated. Target destroyed. Targets destroyed. Targets destroyed. Let me go after the Isa, because they're not going to. Roger, lead. Did Roger. you just shoot me Roger. in the back? Take out the designated target. Roger, six. Roger, Spectre. Roger, lead. Damn it, I keep pressing the wrong button. Eureka! You say Eureka? Roger, copy. Roger, six. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Roger, Spectre. Target destroyed. Target's destroyed. I Target's destroyed. Target taken out. Ammunition depleted. Exceeding recommended level. Target destroyed. Crush you, Freebird! Star Colonel Fastest, I, I hereby claim you as my bondsman. You now serve the Northwind Highlanders under my direct command. Sir, I object. You can't be serious. Planners cannot be trusted. At ease, Lieutenant. I'm in command here. She might be a vicious clan marauder, but now she's our vicious clan marauder. I don't like it at all, sir. I don't need you to like it, Castle. Spectre out. Well, I hope it was everything you wanted, sir. The Clanners have been beaten right. on their own terms, and Merknet is abuzz with our achievement. Whenever a Merc unit takes down Clanners, it can't help but be good for business. So now, every time somebody gets knocked out, they die. And now we have to replace Gator. Right after we go to the Mech Lab and start fixing shit. Let's face it, I'm pretty much never going to use a small laser or a small pulse laser. Or 15 PPCs. Or LRM5s, which is just, uh, in my opinion, if you ask me, that's just lambs fodder. Alright, we lost an awesome.
weapons are okay. Weapons are okay. Weapons are okay. Alright, we are done on New Exford. And heavy class still is not open up, so we're going to stick. Capellan marauders have been pushing on several coastal holdings of tactical significance. Allied units have been spread thin to cover as many as possible. The stick commonality is offering a support contract to back up two lances of Linden's battalion, defending a naval repair facility. Pay looks good. Salvage is split with Linden. We'll just go, oh, heavy here. Do I have another heavy? No, but I can in a minute. The hell just happened? Oh no! That was our first crash. We should be okay though. I don't know what the hell is going on here. Weird. Capellan marauders have been pushed. It did not like the free market for a moment. Is that really the only clan mix I had? Oh no, Vulture. Good, by back in Atlas. We're still one shy of the Steiner Scout Squad. I keep debating on whether or not to actually buy a victor. Alright, Avatar is patterned after Vulture Omnimac recovered from the Battle of Luthien in the Draconis Combine while maintaining resemblance to its parent design. The Avatar is 10 tons heavier, slower, and tends to carry a more diverse mix of weapons. Ooh, excuse me, and a clan mech. Which is weird because in MechWarrior 3 they use these things all the time. In clan territory. That's clan. Rifleman's an option. We haven't played with a rifleman at all. Plan. Inner Sphere. Constructed by Comstar to replace the huge losses incurred in the Battle of Tukid. Intended as a jack of all trades, this mech can make, mount a mixture of lasers, rockets, and missiles. Orion 2C, but no Orion. Can a guy please just get a freaking Highlander? No. No Highlanders. What Comstar cult do I have to join to get a Highlander? That is a very good looking model though. Holy crap, that is a very wide array of weapons. Light AC5, damage 2.5, recycle time 1. Holy shit, a recycle time of 1? Let's 
drop the lambs, get some more speed in here, and another ton of lambs, or light AC5. Uh, okay. I might try driving the Avatar. This is Watchdog 1 to Allied Units! We're getting torn up by All right, the Panorama! Just got we cannot hold position! Watchdog, this is Hammer. We're engaging a heavy lance at Alpha. We need support now. I just lost Gopher and Tabby. Cannot hold! Ah. Roger, Spectre. Roger. This is Spectre 1. Watchdog, fall back toward Allied HQ. We're moving to support Hammer. Three platoons of armor. One click north of Alpha. Watch yourselves. Roger. Spectre elements, engage enemy and give cover for Watchdog. Hammer, how are you holding up? Not good. These guys have a serious weight advantage. We can hold them, but not for long. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Ah, lead. Roger. Copy. Watchdog is clear. Copy. Castle, get Allied Air in here to mop up these ground pounders. We have to relieve Hammer at Alpha. Roger. Allied stilettos are inbound. Time to target six zero seconds. Spectre Lance, disengage and double time it to Alpha. Let the Flyboys clean up here. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Destroyed. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Ah, lead. Roger, Spectre. Roger, six. Take out the designated target. Understood. Copy. Roger, Spectre. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target taken out. Understood. Roger, lead. Roger, lead. We're at 50% strength. Not looking good. Good to see you, Spectre. Looks like you could use a hand. Mind if we cut in? <laughs> they might. Capellan? Don't you snake. All units be advised. SATCOM is tracking a mixed force of mechs and watercraft moving in from offshore. The turret grid at Beta is live, but won't hold out long against this many attackers. Damn. Castle, what is their ETA to beta? Two, three minutes, tops. Finish these guys off fast, people. Roger. Ah, lead. Roger. Roger, lead. Ah. Roger, lead. Roger, Spectre. Target's destroyed. Target taken out. Ah, lead. Copy. Roger. I like have to rip these guys off of um, Hammerlands. Target destroyed. Warning. Damage critical. Affirmative, Spectre. Roger, Spectre. Roger. Point Alpha secure. Acknowledged. 
How close am I to death? Pretty close. Hammer Lance, we'll cover this flank. You hold here. Copy. Thanks for pulling our butts out of the fire, Spectre. Thank the commonality. They're footing the bill. Target destroyed. Target's destroyed. Target's destroyed. Rendezvous at the designated nav point. Understood. Roger, Six. Roger. This late H EC5 is interesting. Very fast reload. Not a lot of damage. Somebody left a vedette alive. Roger! The Naval Yard reports turret grid at 50% strength. Take out the designated target. Roger, lead. Take out the designated target. Affirmative, Spectre. Engaging second Capellan force. Take out the designated target. Roger. Target destroyed! Turrets at 25%. Target destroyed. Enemy detected. Turret grid is combat ineffective, Commander. Target destroyed. Enemy detected. Enemy detected. Target destroyed. Take out the designated target. Roger! Roger. Roger. Target, target destroyed. destroyed! Target destroyed. Target taken out! Affirmative, Spectre! Roger. Roger, Spectre. I need to pull back a bit. How the hell is that thing still alive? Somebody kill it! Kill it! Like, this is the original area that we came running through. And that vedette is still just, like, kind of sitting there. Looks like he's not watching me, though, so we should be okay to take him out. Now he's watching me. Great. Target destroyed. Okay, cool. Take out the designated target. Ah! Roger. Copy. Destroyed. Target destroyed. Target taken out. Understood. Roger. Roger, Spectre. Enemy detected. Target destroyed. Enemy Target's detected. destroyed. Target's destroyed. Ah! Roger, lead. Copy. Target destroyed. Destroyed. Target's destroyed. Target taken out. Take out the designated target. Ah, lead. Roger. Roger six. Naval yard secure. Spectre Lance is on site and awaiting security relief force. Over. Acknowledged, Commander. Allied command anticipates relief Whew. force posting within six hours. Suggest you consolidate. I don't want to see how much armor I had left. Perimeter defense. Roger. We ain't going anywhere. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target's destroyed. The situation here on Stick is teetering on the brink of disaster. Several heads of the commonality have agreed to meet with a Capella no, liaison regarding a ceasefire, though many are calling it a desperate last resort. The commonality is coming apart at the seams with no sure path for the future. Damn. Thug. The Thug is an old and stable design first released as a prototype in 2572 by Maltex Corporation. Based on the popular Warhammer chassis, the Thug boasts a respectable combination of firepower, speed, armor, and electronics. And the Talos, a new 80-ton design from the Free Worlds League. This design is very heavy and ballistic, but still... Ballistics, but still able to carry several racks of missiles as backup weapons. Mounts average electronics. 
still wish they had the Orion in here instead of the Orion 2C. And we're also missing the Highlander still. Avatar's okay. I don't think I'd, I'd run it again. Clan tech. Nope. We'll probably call it a night here. Pick up these Gauss rifles. Because God knows I lose Gauss rifles like nobody's business. Probably call it a night here. Uh, we'll pick it up tomorrow. Again, still running our Inner Sphere tech slash mech and doing the Steiner ending. We'll go through and finish up uh, Stick next time and hit Solaris as well and then probably move on towards the end game, which I think this time will be Hesperus 2. I just go through here, double check, make sure I have what I need. How am I on missiles? I think the capacitor would make it charge faster, but I guess not. Alright, I think that's going to do it for tonight, guys. Thank you very much for coming along. Uh, I'll, pro I'll just tweak with the, the max here real quick before... I start up next time, and that's going to be it for tonight. So everybody, have a good night. If you like what you saw here, hey, hit that follow button. Turn on notifications. You'll get notifications of when I go live. And as always, we are looking for, not that. We're looking forward to MechWarrior 5, which again, here's the MechWarrior 5 biomes update teaser. Right, get that camera out of here.
cannot wait. Two weeks, two weeks, a little over two weeks cannot come soon enough. So that's going to be it for tonight, guys. Hope you enjoyed the show. Spread the word. Let's get more people in here. Anyway, that's it for me tonight. Everybody, have a good night, and I'll catch you guys all tomorrow.